I got asked, would I be interested in writing music for a video game? Um, and I was just intrigued by the idea of doing something different, uh, something I'd, I'd never done before. So I was interested just to see what was involved. You know, the great thing is there's no rules. I mean, I take a songwriting class at Lippa, uh, my old school in, uh, in Liverpool, and I always say to the kids, you know, there's, there's no rules. There's, uh, I, don't know, I don't know how to do it. Um, so, yeah, it, it, it's, um, it can happen any way, uh, but I do like collaboration. I mean, obviously writing with John was the ultimate collaboration. Um, and I, I think you know we we're both very lucky to find each other um, because we played perfectly off each other. Mm -hmm. And an example I always give is I was starting this song called Getting Better. I'm going, it's getting better all the time. And he goes, it couldn't get much worse. Let's <laughs> <laughs> go, hey, okay, come on then, let's think about that. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. you suddenly got the foil to what you're doing. That bang, so the next line isn't just getting better still. Yeah. You know, yeah, it's yeah. now like, oh, okay, we're going there, are we? Great. And so I would do that to his songs, he would do that to mine. First of all, a huge honor to meet you, Paul. I can tell you, you taught me to play the guitar. I remember coming back, not obviously directly, but. You know, one of the amazing things about uh, me and John writing together was that I think we wrote just short of 300 songs together. And I look back on it now uh, in some kind of wonder because we never had a dry session. Mm -hmm. You know, every time we got together and sat down, we'd work for about, normally about three hours, because you sort of get you bit bored after three hours. Um, but we worked for about three hours and, and nearly always come up with a song, which is pretty, pretty cool. cool, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Coming back from chapels in 1969 with this sort of treasure box of the Beatles' White Album sheet music. There's, there's a few knocking around, but I mean, it's difficult that, because why we didn't do anything with them, because we didn't think they were any good. Yeah. So why resurrect them? Okay. You know, it's, uh, <laughs> it gets tempting though, because it was a Lennon McCartney or something, you know, so it's got a certain uh, interest value, if nothing yeah. else. But they're not very good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know, C minor sevenths and F elevens, all these things. I'm talking a bit pompous now. An early song that I was writing with John was one that I'd often one of us would start the song, then the other one would help work on it. And I'd I'd started one that ended up being called I Saw a Stand in There, mm -hmm. an early Beatles song. And um and my opening was um she was just seventeen. She'd never been a beauty queen, you know. If Bob Dylan could have handled, just 17, never been a beauty queen. He could have pulled it off. But, you know, it was like I was uh, stuck and didn't like it, but I plowed on knowing I'd come back to it. And uh, that was around about the time John and I were starting to write together. So I showed him the song, so 17. Never been a beauty queen, and we both kind of cringed, like, ooh, you know, maybe not. Um, and then we come up with, you know what I mean, <coughs> which uh, a comedian friend of mine years later said, no, Paul, I'm not sure we do know what you mean. <laughs> You're just 17, do you know what I mean? <laughs> We met through a friend of mine, uh, it was called Ivan, uh, it was born on the same day as I was in Liverpool, we went to school together, so we were really good mates, and he was friends with, with John, so we went to this uh, village fete, we were both there together, and um, I got to know John through, through Ivan, 
Um, and normally, you know, you'd be talking to people in conversation, so they what's your hobbies, or I like doing this, or like cycling, or like swimming, or... And I would say to people, I like songwriting, you know, I've written a couple of songs, and everyone would go, oh yeah, and ignore it. But John went, oh yeah, so have I. So that was like, hmm? <laughs> what, you've written a couple of songs? Yeah, so, well, show me yours and I'll show you mine, baby. <laughs> so that was what happened. We got together and he showed me the crap he was writing. Yeah. No. <laughs> um, he showed me what he was doing, I showed him the crap I was writing. Uh, and that was basically it. We, we came together through the common interest of songwriting. You know, be, and you'd listen to records a lot and play one little section with a chord you didn't know.